Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Caravan's ATC. This is a viewer request and we're going to be asking the questions, what is it, how does it work and is it worth the money? So come and join us. So ATC, or to give it its full name, Auto Trailer Control. Now it does more or less what it says it does. It's made by Alco. Now Alco manufacture most, if not all, the current chassis uh, for modern caravans in the UK. Uh, there are other manufacturers, but primarily in the UK, they use Alco. And ATC works in conjunction with the stabilizer, the AKS stabilizer, like this one. So what does it do? ATC is a electrical and mechanical box which is fitted in between the axle uh, on the uh, floor of the chassis and it is connected to the push rod system for the braking and also the brakes for the drums themselves. Now what it does basically is it is reduces anti-snaking and when I mean by anti-snaking it means if the rear gets out of line at the back and it's moving what it will do, it will apply the brakes gently, allowing the caravan to realign as you're still traveling. It's not an ABS system like some people think it is. It's just for that side to side motion you get on the, on the caravan. Now, what I will say is it's a fantastic tool, but it doesn't give you a license to exceed the speed limit while you're towing and hope that that will save your life if the back starts to go at high speeds it won't do that so it's not a license to speed with your caravan now alco claim that this once fitted uh, does not require any service or maintenance it's a one fit at all system and you should once fitted just leave it leave it be but there are a couple of little things that I'll mention in a minute that you need to look out for. Now, if you choose to have ATC fitted to your caravan retrospectively, you will get a 12 months warranty. If you're buying a brand new caravan and you decide to have it fitted at the factory, you get three years, which runs in conjunction with the caravan's warranty as well. So can there any, be any faults with the ATC system? Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain the LED system and how that works and a couple of little things that I noticed with my experience over the last five years with using it. So let's take a look at the LED system and I'll show you what I'm on about. So just to keep things simple, what I've done is I've uh, uploaded the operation uh, LED chart from Alco and then I'll just explain my experiences with what went wrong for me. Now in my case this happened to me a couple of years ago I'll leave a link to the video uh, at the top of the screen but basically uh, I came to my caravan one day uh, and I collect, connected the uh, electrical hook, hookup cable and there was nothing so I tested the actual um, cable uh, and that was fine and what I discovered was the plug which puts the power to the ATC underneath the caravan had come sl slightly loose and as a result of that there was no power getting to the ATC. Once I pushed that in it was fine. Now the other thing I did have an issue with is I heard the whirring noise once and there was no LED at all. So I could actually tow it so I whipped round to the dealers and they just discovered that the actual LED was at fault. So that's another issue that you could potentially have with it. As they say, it is maintenance free, but there are a couple of things that you need to look out for, and they are the ones. Well folks, that is my overview and brief explanation of ATC, uh, the auto trailer control from Alco. Now, uh, we've had it on our caravan since new, and it's been probably used, as I've felt it personally, uh, twice. Now they say you shouldn't really feel it but on these two occasions that I'm going to explain it was quite severe so yes we did feel it uh, actually do its job. One was we were overtaking a lorry, uh, we were in the second lane and some prat in a van came right at the side of the caravan uh, and the car uh, really fast uh, in, a, in a van and it caused another vacuum which allowed the back to sway. As a result of that, the ATC uh, did its job and brought the caravan gently back into alignment, which was quite scary at first because it was quite severe. 
The second time was, I was <laughs> it's another lorry, I was overtaking a lorry, uh, quite a high sided one, and there was a bit of a crosswind and as I got past the lorry, the back end of the caravan caught the wind and it started to move. And yes, again, the ATC helped us out there, brought it gently back into alignment. Now then, would I recommend it? Yes, I would. Um, I think it's a really good piece of kit, especially if you've never towed before and you're new and you've bought a caravan and you're a bit, a bit unsure, then it, it might be a peace of mind as well as actually being a useful tool. Also, uh, somebody asked me, um, well, is it suitable for eight foot wide? Well, to be honest, it's suitable for any caravan, especially one, you know, 26 foot long, the, the longer caravans like mine, or it doesn't matter the, really the width, it's more the length of the caravan I would recommend it on. Some people might disagree, but personally, that's how I see it. So with mine, I think it's a real godsend. It's done me uh, a service and I've been very pleased with it. Uh, we had, like I said in the video, we did have a couple of minor hiccups with it when we first got it. But other than that, we've not had any issues with it at all and it's worked perfectly. Well, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you'll join us again. If you've not subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing and also hit the thumbs up button. It does help the channel and it helps us uh, in, and encourages us to make more videos to help you out. Well, thank you very much. Bye for now.